Should Santa Claus be welcome inside the Christian home? The first Santa Claus was actually Saint Nicholas, who loved Jesus. He also loved using the resources he had to bless and give to children. Well, he sounds like a pretty good guy. However, the Santa Claus we have now doesn't really resemble him at all. Oh, so the new Santa's evil then. Gotcha. That's not what I said. You see, the Bible says is that God is our father. And just as our fathers on earth would want to give his children good gifts, so does he. God wants you to have fun. He wants you to have good things. God's not wanting all the heathen kids to go and have fun and believe in Santa while the Christians have a miserable time. As Christians, we should be having the most fun. Go Santa, go Santa. Yeah, but telling your kids Santa's bringing them gifts, isn't that actually a lie? Yeah, it is. Well, that's it then, you bring Santa in, you're definitely going to hell. Thanks. Not necessarily. The Bible also teaches that we're not saved by our works, but by the grace and love of Jesus when he gave his life on a cross and died for you and then rose again in three days. Nothing you do can make God love you more or love you less than he already does right now, including letting your kids believe in Santa Claus. So you're saying we can just do whatever we want and still get to heaven? No, but I'm sure some of you are gonna say that. I'm saying our obedience to Christ should be all because of our love for him and wanting to reciprocate at least some small piece of what he did for us on that cross. Not to just ensure we're going to heaven. So, wait a minute, now I'm totally confused. Should we do Santa or should we not? So I guess the question should be for you and your home. Is Santa Claus causing a distraction or are you still finding a way to give glory to Jesus and giving him the honor for what's happening? And Santa Claus is just an extra that comes along with the holiday. Or, if you really want to get down to it, we need to stop finding reasons to divide the body of Christ. Whether you let Santa Claus be a part of your family or you don't, it doesn't change salvation. Jesus came, he gave his life, he died for you, he rose again. Santa Claus doesn't affect your salvation and it shouldn't affect us as a body of Christ. Ultimately, the issue of Santa Claus is just one more way that the enemy has found to keep us divided and out of unity with one another as brothers and sisters in Christ. Is Christmas a pagan holiday? Is Santa bad? Are tattoos evil? Should we celebrate Halloween? All these things are issues that don't even matter. All that matters is Jesus came to this earth and lived a perfect life and he died for you so that now you have a direct link to God and we can spend eternity in heaven because our sins have been paid for. Our job is to teach our children how to tell others about Jesus. As parents, that's what we should be focused on. I can't give you a black and white answer if Santa Claus is good or if it's bad, but if those little issues don't affect the gospel, let them go. Let's be unified. Let's team up together and win this world for Jesus. There's nothing wrong with making Christmas fun for your kids, but let's not ever forget what it's really about. And let's always make sure they know what it's about. So, no matter what you decide to do, Merry Christmas. I'm Kelly Kay. I love you. Jesus loves you. Be blessed, and we'll see you next time.